What's up guys, welcome to this video. This is Dan's How To Videos and today I'm going to be showing you how to hook up your computer. Now we're going to be using your MacBook Pro here, but how to hook up your MacBook Pro to your TV. Now I've got a Samsung TV right here. It is plugged in, which is good. So I'm just going to go ahead and turn that on. But you're going to need a couple of things. Right here we have uh, some HDMI cables. You can pick these up really cheap on Amazon. I'll put a link in the description so you can check that out. And you're going to need a mini display port to HDMI adapter. Um, this is standard as well. You can get it really cheap on Amazon. I think I picked this one up for under $10. So I'm going to open this up for the first time since these just came in. And uh, I mean, this is just a generic brand, so you don't really need to go with Apple on all of them. So what you need to do first is hook this into your MacBook. Now I'm going to try to get this so you guys can see it here. You have an adapter here, it's a little lightning port, uh, a lightning port for it, and you're just going to basically push this in and that will automatically give you the adapter here for the uh, HDMI cable and you can go ahead and plug that into there as well. So put the adapter in and then plug your HDMI cable to the adapter. I'm going to do that right now. Both of these things are new. And again, I got this HDMI on Amazon. I think it was like $3, crazy. But uh, you just wanna make sure you don't get a crappy one. This will. This is not gonna be crazy good. It's a short uh, HDMI cable, but if you're hooking your computer up to your TV, you don't really need too much of a length here. Now, so as I said, you're gonna hook this into your, uh, your HDMI adapter at the bottom here. And I'm gonna move the camera over so you can see exactly how this looks. Okay, so this is the back of my TV right here, and what I've done with the MacBook is very simple. I've just hooked up my cable here, my HDMI cable to the adapter, and the adapter is hooked right into the MacBook itself. So it's pretty simple. Do that first. Go ahead, plug that in. Next thing is you're going to plug in the other end of your HDMI cable. Mine has a slot on the side, yours might be in the back, depending on your TV. You're just going to go ahead and plug that in to the HDMI cable on your TV set. And once that's all plugged in, you're pretty much set up with your hardware. The next thing is actually going into your computer, setting that up, and then also setting up on your TV. So we'll get into that right now. Alright, so this is the point we're at right now. We've got everything hooked up hardware-wise, the HDMI cable into the computers with the adapter hooked up to the MacBook here. Now all I have to do with my remote is, on my remote here is, there's a source button. I'm just going to go ahead and press source and what you need to do is change this so you're into your HDMI source from your TV. Now you can do this with the remote. There's usually a setting on the bottom. I can do this with the source setting up here or I can even go into my menu. But uh, just for time, I'll just go ahead and push source and change it. And here we are. Now you have an extended monitor. So whatever I'm seeing here, I can drag over them. So I'm going to go ahead and just uh, hold and bring it over. So I'm just tapping and dragging it over. It's almost like your monitor is here and you can move more over. So you can move everything that goes past this part of your monitor here is going to become visible on this screen. So you just drag it over and uh, you can make it full screen on this one. And there you go. So I can go ahead and watch one of my YouTube videos here and uh, play it on my TV screen. Go ahead and try this one. There you go. So that's pretty much it. That's how you do that. Also, there's one more thing here. If you wanted to change up the settings at all, uh, let me just make this smaller again. If you wanted to change any of the settings with your monitor, all you have to do is go into your system preferences. I'll actually open this up on the big screen here so you can see it better. You just open up your system preferences, go into displays, and you'll have some settings here. You can set up the arrangements so it could be an extended screen or you can change it to um, so it's like just one big screen or sorry, two screens. You can move it from one side to the other side, see how it's lit up. Now I can drag it to be on this side so everything on this side of the screen now will be my will be visible if I drag it to the left. You can change it up any way you want. It's pretty simple, pretty standard stuff. And uh, that's how you watch, I guess, 
computer stuff on your TV. And uh, this is with the MacBook Pro, 15 inch model non-retina display, but it's pretty much the same deal with all MacBooks or even the iMac, you can do the exact same thing. All right guys, hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you found it helpful, hit that thumbs up button. Let me know what you thought in the comments and I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.